what I'm going to tie here is just a basic cormorant, uh, nothing too fancy. Uh, you can tie cormorants in many different ways, but the way I like it is to be quite thin uh, and not too heavy. Now I'm starting with a B175 size 10, Wisp 14 old black thread again. I'm just going to tie thread in, trim the edge off. What I'm going to use here is basically some medium red holographic tinsel for the rib. So I'll catch that in here just now and I'll wind it back. I also like comments to have quite a short body. So I'll take the thread just past the point of the hook. What I'm now going to do is take a couple of pieces of peacock herald. This peacock herald has been dyed, uh, blood red. All I'm going to do, I'm going to tie it in at the tips. A couple of turns back the way and then go back forward. Okay, and just go right forward. Now you can tie it a lot shorter than this as well. And just to give the peacock a little bit of strength. I'm just going to put some varnish down and then I'll just get both of the heralds and wind them forward you can see I'm starting to try to go forward on me so what I'm doing is just pulling it back and it's actually making it stronger because it's sticking down more on the varnish Just catch it in and trim the hero. At this point, I like to actually just trim off and make it a bit thinner, same as what I do with my crunchers, taking care not to cut the rib. Now, I'm going to do a couple of turns at the butt of the holographic, and I'm just going to wind holographic forward four turns catch it in and trim it I'll do a small bit finish here so it doesn't all come apart and I'm just going to push that back now Tying comments. Basically, what you want to use is the tip of the feather, so it's a bit that a lot of people throw away. Marabou black, and then just pull it. So I want it just hanging off the back of the hook. Catch it in. Just pull it up, trim the excess off, and just tidy that up. Now you can leave it like that, you can put a bit of holographic up the side, you can put jungle cock cheeks on it, you can do a lot of different things. But what I'm going to do is put up some buy it, blood red buy it's up the side. So, I'm just going to get a couple of bites. Okay, trim them off. I'll always do the side nearest me first. So, I'll catch that in. Five, six, seven, seven thumbs. Just grab it and pull it, and it should rip off. And just line the one up the other side. Looking from the top down, you can usually get the, the length correct. Catch it in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Catch, rip, and then just tidy the head up.
double whip finish. It's a great fly on any water. Now as I say, you can there's that many different combinations of colours and bodies, but for the marabou, I like to use black blacks and olive, and sometimes I'll use sunburst with orange. There you go. Red holographic comet. 